Is that it? Did you bring the money? Not before I see the dagger. I'm proud of you, Raymond. I never thought you'd ever be the one to get it. But I did. And now you take it. It's yours. Give me the money. Whatever you're paying, Solomon, you're paying too much. Who are you, my friend? That's not important. What is important is whoever buys that dagger buys a lot of trouble. Don't listen to him. Go away. What do you mean, a lot of trouble? That dagger belongs in the lost temple of the sun. If you don't take it back there, if you keep it, the curse touches you. <laughs> I don't believe in curses, my friend. Well, you better start, Solomon. Saunders? Yes, in person. Tell Solomon, huh? Tell him how many men died with that dagger in their hands. What? I, I, I never heard of any man dying with it. Take my word for it. They were the lucky ones. Yes, that I can see, Professor. <laughs> Pitiful. A living legend gone to rot. Perhaps there is a curse. Oh, Raymond, now I don't know. I, he, they... They're working a con to lower the price. Can't you see that? Get out of here. This doesn't belong to you anymore. It doesn't belong to any of us here. It belongs in the temple. And we're gonna take it back. Not on your life. This time you won't crawl away. Michael, lunch in five seconds. Four, three, two, one. <laughs> Time to catch your lunch, Michael. Space dogs, 11 o'clock. Look out, flying fries. Got him. Michael, the ring fighters. No problem. The Galactic Battle Burger. Michael? Well then, I'm fine. <laughs> Presenting Lipton noodles and sauce Alfredo. So delicious, so simple. Lipton noodles and sauce Alfredo with that delicately seasoned taste. My daredevil needs more than knee pads to protect his little bones. He needs Kraft singles. Unlike imitations, Kraft is made from five ounces of milk per slice, so his bones get calcium. Let my daredevil go unprotected? Not with Kraft singles. Since you obviously can't taste a score candy bar during a commercial, we'd like to show you what it tastes like. Score is one of the most luxurious, indulgent tastes imaginable. Sumptuous milk chocolate surrounding crunchy, buttery toffee. The next time you take a moment out during the day, make it a truly special moment. Indulge yourself with the rich, luxurious taste of score. Friday. California was a great idea for a honeymoon. Amanda, in the car! Lee and Amanda's honeymoon is cut short by a sniper's bullet. I love you, Mrs. Stetson. Scarecrow and Mrs. King. Sunday, when a friend takes a fall for murder... Harry was framed. Can Jessica KO the killer? This time he's gonna be after you. Ernest Borgnine, LeVar Burton, Jerry Orbach, and Angela Lansbury star in a special 90-minute Murder, She Wrote. Then, Julia's got competition. She has a butt you could serve tea on. Tell her with guest stars. It's all over. Designing women. And when a veteran cop makes a fatal mistake to that drug-crazed prisoner. It was my gun. Who will pay? Hard copy, Sunday. If you're deep in drugs and you want out, the people who love you will understand and they'll help you. Give their love a try. Reach out. Don't move. I'm sorry, Simon. I pulled the rug out once again. All right, get it over with. Shut up. Shut up. Raymond, Raymond, you were really quite amusing, I must say. Perhaps you should keep the dagger for a while, and if there is a curse and some ill fate befall you, fear not. I shall claim your body and have you stuffed. Enough jokes. We had a deal, Solomon. I delivered. Jake, run! Quick! 
Let go of me. Do you want to be an idiot all your life? They have the dagger. Yes, and they are returning it to the temple, where there are even greater treasures to plunder. Very clever, that little man. Look, I know, I know that, Tilly, but I didn't have that many heroes. Do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. There was a very wise man, Simon, who once said that shining heroes are best viewed from afar, not up close, where they can lose their sparkle. Simon, I can't let you do this. Do what? There's no sense in bringing my black cloud into your life any more than I already have. Jake, wait! Jake! Jake, I am not going to let you walk out of here believing all this cursed nonsense. Am I going to pack this or are you? My responsibility. Simon, did I ever tell you that as a student you were a right royal pain? <laughs> yeah, I'll finish packing. Yeah, I gotta go get my knapsack. Wait a minute, wait a minute. You're not going, no way. You don't give the orders around here, Buster. I do when it means getting in the lost temple of the sun. I mean, it's bad enough carrying one curse. I don't need some skirt tagging along. I'll wear pants. Now, you listen to no, me. No, you listen to me, you sad sack of brittle old bones. You think I don't know about danger? I dined with the butcher of Bangkok, spent 20 years crossing the South China Seas with men who could hurt you so bad, your grandparents would feel it. Now, the only reason I want to go along is to make very sure that you don't drop the ball and end up hurting Simon. I don't intend to hurt anyone. In fact, I no longer intend going at all. What's the matter? Afraid you can't cut it? You hey, listen. hey, wait a minute. What's all this all Simon? What's going been? on? I've never taken a woman on the before, He's but I don't afraid intend to take one on now. Well, I can't even go out and... Front wheel drive's gone out. Well, don't look at me. You're the one that's cursed. It's all right. I'll just go out and see if I no, can. No, no, honey. This is a back and shoulders up. Okay, and hit it! <laughs> Silly, I'm really sorry. No, that's all right. I haven't had a good mud pack facial in years. You know, according to my map, I think we've made a wrong turn someplace. Well, it's 20 years since I made this map, and things have changed a lot around here since then. Yeah, but look, here, there's a highway running someplace near here. Yeah, but up to that point. After that, we go off into the wilderness. I mean, it is called the Lost Temple of the Sun. They don't expect you to drive right up and see it, huh? I mean, up... What the devil is that? Ah, uh, this is Grunt. Could get us out of this. Grunt? <laughs> okay, put the sticks under, Jake. Okay, Tilly, I'll tell you when to hit it. Right, hit it! <laughs> Looks like my curse has just claimed its first victim. 
Absolutely, that was delicious. <laughs> like to decide for myself. Oh, well, there you are. Oh. Well, if you need me, I'll be in surgery. Mm-hmm. Join me. Thank you. this dagger get its curse? That was used to sacrifice virgins. And by the Jago King for cutting the hearts out of living females and eating them raw. That was his favorite utensil. Oh, shoot. Uh, doesn't it know we're putting it back? <laughs> You're not cursed. Clumsy, maybe. Now, you see, the curse, it works like a magnetic field. It affects everyone around me, but I'm the one who took it out of the temple, so I'm the one who's cursed by it. Hmm. Simon, you say you cursed yourself. What would you say? Oh, I've seen a lot of things that hard to explain. Like a man rising out of his grave in Haiti, a ghost ship that lost its crew one at a time. Curses, I don't know, but... If they're out there, I think we ought to fight them off. Hey, 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 you, you, okay, my, my, my eyes are bigger than my stomach. No, 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 I insist. Simon is right. It's delicious. Prince. Tilly. Hmm? Did you really have dinner with the butcher of Bangkok? Took me right to his fortress. I never was much of a looker, but he seemed to like what was left. Yeah, he was a murderer, but a man of infinite good taste. Thank you. I tell you, I sat there pinching my knees. I was that scared. But he behaved like a perfect gentleman. You know, he nearly cut my head off with a saber. When I stole back from him the rings of Ming. You done that. Well, I'll be a wide-eyed girl. You done that. Yeah, and took it back to where it belonged. The Thailand National Museum. Why couldn't I have done that with a dagger? I don't know, Jake. Why couldn't you? I've put my life on the line a hundred times to bring back a piece of history to some museum where people can stare at it and lie to themselves of how far we've come. But never have I come so close to death so many times as when I entered the lost Temple of the Sun. There it was. There it was in the idol's hand. And suddenly, I didn't want anyone else to have it, or even look at it. Yeah. I should have died, then and there. Oh. Can I have a hit of that? Um. What are you doing? Oh, I just got it for a toast, not for a crutch. Woman! We're going into hell tomorrow! Well, I dare say you and I have been there and back a couple of times, huh? So here's to the lost temple of the sun and to hell and back. <laughs> <laughs> Would you happen to have an extra sleeping bag? There are things crawling around down here. Present company included. You invited yourself, Raymond, so don't be presumptuous. The first thing I do when I get that dagger back is to carve them up into little pieces with it. Oh, I will. You can count on it. Can it wait? I'd like to first give them the opportunity of leading us to the treasure of the lost temples. After that... You can do with them what you please. <laughs> Good things have always come in small packages until now. Because Snickers bars just got bigger. And for satisfying your hunger, bigger sure means better. Because bigger means more peanuts. More peanuts.
peanut butter nougat. More caramel, more milk chocolate, more Snickers to satisfy your hunger for the very same price. Packed with peanuts, Snickers really satisfies. Now in a big way. Satisfies you. McDonald's presents a spectacle of enormous proportions. Double cheeseburger, double fries. McDonald's double features. McDonald's delicious double cheeseburger and double fries. Take the Legs Sheer Elegance Touch Test and feel the difference. This feels coarse. Mmm, so silky. That's the silky difference of Legs Sheer Elegance. In silky support and control top two. Just like you were here. Oh, he kept changing things. Standard time, using oh, yeah, the well. phone. Let's <clears throat> smell this. That's not Downy. Because only Downy gets your wash caressingly soft while it rinses in that April fresh smell. Mmm, that's more like it. Catch this. Feels good to have you back, Mom. The soft April freshness of Downy. The wizard will continue. Tonight on CBS... What do we do now? We get caught. You've had better plans. It's Simon and Simon on the case with evidence that's concrete. <laughs> this is CBS. Does it ever worry you when going to see your banker? Do you put on your best suit? Take an extra peek in the mirror? Then get downtown only to wait for your appointment and be made to feel they're watching you more closely than your money? Come to Mid-Kansas Federal. We started small, but we understand vision and we invest in it. Got a good idea? Come see us. We've got a few of our own. Mid-Kansas Federal. We're everything banks should be, but aren't. Our newsroom works together for a common goal, and that is to put the best newscast we can on the air. And it always amazes me as every day people are patting each other on the back saying good job or giving some advice as to how we could have done that better. I've never worked in a newsroom where everybody works together so much. You know, without it, it wouldn't go on. Senator Dole, tonight at 10 on the Nightcast. I have a feeling I left something back at camp. Well, Jake said, from now on, we can only carry what we need most. See? He's traveling light. Hey, come on! What are we waiting for? Come on! We're in luck. The river's down. Yeah, but how far once we get across? I'll let you know. Now listen, Buster. This is whole thing Silly is just... Silly Jake will let us know. Now we have to go south of, along that cliff face, right? Well, lead on, Professor. Simon, will you stop calling me Professor? I've told you before. I'm in no what else position to clear? teach anyone. Well, wait, Come on. Professor, I... This had better be worth my while, or I'll kill all three just to slow them down. All right, we cross. This is it. This is for. I don't see any temple. Well, you're not supposed to. Well, how do we get inside? Cautiously, my friends. Very cautiously. Is this a leverage system? So you did pay attention after all, huh? We have to stand right in the middle in the exact point of balance or else or else what? Well, if we ever find that out, it'll be the last thing we ever learn. I'll go first. Yeah. 
Tilly. You're next. Careful, careful, careful. How much weight will it take? Well, I had one good man with me last time. I lost him on the way in. I think I've lost a little weight. I would have thought you and Tilly were plenty, but uh, see what I can do. All right, but be careful, huh? Careful. Careful. Don't move. Don't move. Can we get off now, or is it still dangerous? We can get off all right, but the danger has just begun. Years ago, I barely got in and out of there alive, and now I'm just a, a shell of my former self. You've got to do it. You've got to get that dagger back. I thought you didn't believe in curses. I don't believe in curses. I believe in you. I know you've got to put that dagger back so you can believe in yourself again. You don't know what's in there. It's the Aztecs we're dealing with. Masters of treachery. Inside there is one diabolical trap after another to say nothing of the false leaves and slow death. You once told me that the past was the key to who we are now. Doesn't being here remind you of how you used to feel? Where'd you find that? Well, What'd you bring them for? They're for you. No. No, no, no. They, they belong to a different era, a different man. I'm not worthy of that. Do you really want to go in there? We do. It goes for me, too. Oh, all right. You've come this far. Put those away. Let's light the torches. I can't make head or tail of it. Well, it says, I am the blood lord of the higher people. This is my house. Enter and you die. Well, I guess this predated the welcome mat. So what do we do now? You have to use that passageway to the left. The last time I used the other one, I got out one step ahead of an avalanche. Why are there two passageways? Well, because the slaves who built the temple had a secondary passage that they could use to get in and out of while they were completing the traps on the main one. So those traps are still set then? Right. right. Main passageway it is. Door. Well, there should be a catch somewhere. I think I've got it. Uh, be careful. Now, pull the steady pressure, huh? I don't know about you fellas, but I find this real exciting. We're opening a door that's been closed for a thousand years. <laughs> That 400 years till you. Spanish 16th century. Yeah, and you see? He discovered something a bit late. There is no warning. You wrote in your book that the Aztecs were very methodical, mathematical people. Yes, it's true. I remember the last time there was a trap every 30 paces. 15, 16, 17. 18, 19, 18, 19, 21, 22, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30! How do you know how big an Aztec's pieces are? Well, I think they're a little longer than yours, Simon. Sometimes being small 
does have advantages. Let's go. Shake it first. I loathe pulp at the top of my lemonade. Hey, they're in. Hurry, let's go. Patience, Raymond. We'll let them encounter the hazards before we stroll in after them. Like walking through a minefield. Worse. They're only in the ground. These can be in the walls, in the ceiling, anywhere. <clears throat> Is there anyone still counting paces? Well, it seems that what I learnt before means nothing in this corridor. Shh. Can you hear that? How could I have missed it? What is it? Sounds like compressed air. It is. The Aztecs had a way of using air as a triggering device, and I almost led you right into it. That's all right, Jack. I've got no business to be here. Oh, nonsense. Now that you know what it is, you can get us past it. What do you think it triggers? Darts, probably. Poison darts. Well, how do we get past them? I've got an idea. Simon, look out. Simon. Are you OK? Gonna need a new bag. I'm proud of you, Simon. You're a good student. Well, I had a good teacher. Yeah, but we've got a long way to go yet. What is it? The embodiment of the curse, pure evil. Well, it might be on the wall, but it's not on you. Simon, will you come here a minute, please? I think it's on me. Don't move, Teddy. It's all right. I just want to know where he's headed. Just by your left hand, right there. There. All right, now you crawl back under a rock, baby, OK? I say duck. Duck! Duck, Tilly! Yeah. Let's go! Now, Tilly, there's more to you than meets the eye. Huh. I'll take that as a compliment. <laughs> Jake? Hey, wait a minute. Tell us something. Now, wait a minute. Ah! We'll get you out of there, Jake. Oh. Hang tight. Oh. Hang tight. These things don't budge. Folks, better leave. You won't want to see this. Oh, clam up and suck in that gut. Shh. to the mechanism. Good skinny. We've got time. It's getting lower, you know. Quiet. Hold on. Plenty of space. Come closer. Quiet. I found it. Which way? Jake? Well, the assets consider left-handed people the more gifted, the wisest, so... It's a good idea. You can't always trust the Aztecs. Look, Jake, sunlight! Oh! There it is. The 
I don't doubt so. Empty-handed. Well, then it's time to get him back his dagger. Will you do the honors, Professor? Once your children leave home, there's no telling what evil lurks. No kids. No No thanks. Which is why we suggest you arm them with snack-sized Dannon mini packs. One cup is small enough to fit in a child's pocket. No thanks. Delicious enough to fight off all temptation. And because it's pure Dannon yogurt, you'll know your child's in good hands. No thanks. Even when he isn't in yours. Dannon is yogurt in snack-sized mini packs. What mascara looks spectacular on? That shrugs off water, but not soap and water? Clean Lash by CoverGirl. The waterproof mascara that's soap and water washable. Clean Lash, only from CoverGirl. In 15 seconds, can you tell which nail is wet and which one is dry? This one or this one? Can't tell, can you? CoverGirl Nail Slicks, color that looks wet even when it's dry. Set it down gently, fellas. That explains it, Caper. What? The buttery taste of your townhouse crackers. I knew there was a logical explanation. Yes, sir. Elf and magic. Right. That's why Caper townhouse crackers taste so rich and buttery. Just elf and magic. Right. Well, I'll let you elves get back to work. <laughs> Keebler Townhouse with a rich buttery taste and now low salt townhouse. Same buttery taste with only half the salt. You got anything in there that'll help us escape? Well, you might say so. Oh, yeah. what about you, Simon? Oh, that won't help. Oh, what about Grunt? Mm. I couldn't fix him. Oh, what else you got in there? I'm out of tricks. Oh. oh. Jake, listen, you got out of tight spots before you're gonna help us now. Have a nip, it won't hurt so much. Oh, it's getting crowded in here, Simon. Sunlight. This is it. What? It reflects the light. What's that for? Jake once taught me the Aztecs invented the first automatic door. Oh, thank you, sir. Now, how do we get out of here? Oh, would you look at the... How do you feel about that, folks? Well, the Aztecs were harsh but fair. If you beat them at their own game, they rewarded you. Then I'll put the dagger back. It's all yours, Simon. Oh. Be my guest. You know, this time around, he didn't want to lead. He wanted to follow. He wanted you to save us. Well, he didn't do too badly. You still don't get it, do you? You were his hero. Someone to look up to, someone to be like. I don't want to be anybody's hero. You know where the real Jake Saunders is? This curse swatted him and spat out what's left. Here. The thing I don't understand is how a man could live so fully and be in such a hurry to die. Simon? Where's Jake? Back there under his cloud. Put that thing back and let's go home. Would you look at that? I see 
the inner chamber. Drake wrote about it in his book, but he couldn't find it. He must have been here at the wrong time. The light wasn't coming in at the right angle. What's that? Jake! Jake! Wait till you see... Where is he? He's probably running out of here with his tail between his legs. Well, 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 look what we found. Raymond, be a good fellow and go and check the treasure room for booby traps. That's what you pay them for. Their hands are occupied. Yeah, but... Quickly now. I've had about all I can take of this damp Aztec air. Solomon, I wouldn't take any of that if I were you. But you are not me. I must confess I had little faith in Professor Saunders. But who can doubt the rampant genius of Simon Mackay? It's all right. Look at it all. I plan on doing much more than look. As for the two of you, Raymond, come here and take your precious dagger back. And with it, sacrifice our friends to the Aztec gods. <laughs> Hold everything, you sons of Jake! Oh, we did all right, didn't we? Thank you, Simon. Of course, Professor. Oh, dear. I was so hoping for a happy ending. Jake, listen to me. I'm, I'm willing to forfeit half my private collection or anything, but... We can't allow this dagger to rot in some museum for the edification of common people. We can negotiate. We, we can work it out, Jake. Jake, remember you're a gentleman. Well, I've been accused of many things, but where did you ever hear that? <laughs> Don't go away. Winning, it's easy. Give 110%, expect 110%. From yourself, everyone, everything. Speed stick deodorant gives 110%. That's its edge. Why? It has no alcohol, and alcohol evaporates. Speed stick protection doesn't evaporate even after 24 hours. Glides on dry in just a few strokes. That's 110% protection. Speed stick deodorant, the wide stick. That's your edge. I men and... McDonald's presents a spectacle of enormous proportions. Double cheeseburger, double fries. McDonald's double features. McDonald's delicious double cheeseburger and double fries. Get the love your kitty saving with a crave for every craving. Crave Cat Food introduces new seafood recipe, poultry recipe, and what every kitty already craves, original recipe crave. Now your cat can have his crave in variety, too. Oh, my kitty cat. Friday, one marriage is healed. A suite at one of Dallas's finest hotels. Another ripped apart. I finally got you out of my system. Dallas and oh, God. a new baby on board. Which one of you do I congratulate? A new player in the game. Robert Stack joins Falcon Crest Friday. Monday. Wouldn't it be great if they got together? Yeah. Wouldn't it be great if we helped? No. Kate and Allie give Lewis a lesson in love. Like on Dynasty? Then, when J.D.'s wife gives him the boot, guess who gets a new roommate? What am I gonna do, stay here forever? Call her. My sister Sam. And, on Newhart, the Loudons go on an adventure. Come on, if you wanted me to be spontaneous. Dick, this time, no reservations? Only if we cross through Navajo territory. <laughs> and... Idiot! Yuppie. Art Carney guests on the Kavanaugh's. This is my side, and that's your side. It all happens Monday. Tell 
really don't worry. I'm sure when Jake gets to write the return of the Aztec dagger, he'll immortalize you in word and deed. Mm, I don't know. I said some pretty awful things to him. Perhaps he needed to hear them. <laughs> Shh. Hello? Oh! Oh, hi, Alex. Welcome home. Hi, hey. the wedding. It was wild. It was really a great time. Oh, good. Oh. These are for you, Tilly. Oh. Thank you, they're beautiful. I had the lucky number under my plate. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, how was everything here? Anything exciting happen? Here? It's no exciting, nothing. No. Just the way you left it. Simon, what happened to your hat? My hat? Yeah, your hat. Oh, um... What do you think happened? Uh, we were walking through an Aztec temple and uh, it's full of booby traps and a spear came out from the wall, went right through the hat. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> Look, guys, I'm sorry we're so dull, but better dull than dangerous. <laughs> Next, on The Wizard. I know you help people, so please help my baby be safe. His name is Joey. Oh, no, don't cry. He'll copy you. Sell Joey? I either get my money or I get your baby. I'm here for my baby. Come on, let's get out of here. What's this all about? Just help me out, OK? Joey's ours. He belongs to us. Alex said something about you owing some money. Give him a cage phone number. I want to talk to him. Let's see the baby. Tonight on Notch Landing, Peter's put in a dilemma when a sudden disappearance fuels deadly rumors. But first, the discovery of Indian artifacts sets the stage for kidnap and murder on Simon & Simon, next.